officials tracking a new Omicron subvariant already reported in at least 55 countries, including here in the U.S. Omicron variant. Omicron. 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 The emerging BA2 form of the Omicron coronavirus variant does not seem to be any more severe than the original BA1 form, a World Health Organization official said on Tuesday. Hi, my name is Richard and I am currently studying at the University of Oxford. And this is just another day in the life of an Oxford postgraduate student from the Philippines. taking another postgraduate degree and this time with University of Oxford. But because late lumabas yung admission ko and late ako nakapag-enroll, wala pa ako student visa. So, so currently, because I still don't have my student visa yet, I am doing the postgraduate program. So first of all, I'd like to show you my setup. So my setup is quite different. One, because this is not an online program, but rather it's currently being conducted inside the classroom. And some of my fellow students are actually there or physically inside the classroom. Unfortunately, for students from countries with travel restriction that could not come yet to Oxford, we need to do it online. So this is called a hybrid learning and not an online learning. Because again, this postgraduate program is not an online program. So for my online setup, this one, I'll tell you now before I start my classes. So for my setup, I usually stay here. So I have all this reading materials na I'm not yet done reading and I have to cram it later. Of course, my notebook and highlighters and I have my MacBook here for research. No? If I need to search something or if I don't understand something while the prof is discussing. And then this one for the iMac, this would be my main screen. This is where I will be watching the lecture or the classroom discussion. And then I, I do have an iPad as well, which happens to be my third screen. Uh, this is used for group works or for breakout rooms. Because it's a hybrid program, we still work with our classmates or cohorts. We still work with them, no, even if they are there physically and some of us are online. And of course, I just have a ring light for light. There we go. So my classes usually begin at 12 p.m. UK time or 7 p.m. Philippine time. Currently, it's around 6 p.m. I have one hour to prepare. So I'm about to take my shower and then dress up as if I'm going to school. And of course, I have to dress up properly because I'm taking up a business course and there should always be proper decorum, especially um, even if it's in front of the Zoom camera. No, so we still do the same effort as if we're inside the actual classroom. And of course, in respect to my classmates na nandun talaga sila sa classroom or nandun talaga sila sa actual classroom. Okay? So, I have one hour to prepare before my class starts. So, join me. Uh, my class usually starts at 7 p.m. and ends around 1 a.m. or 2 a.m. So, it's going to be a long night but we can do this. Guys, uh, hesitation. Uh, I have to wear my earphones. Oh yes, I'm here. Hi everyone. Good afternoon. It's nice to do another program in Oxford, Said, as always. So my name is Richard. I am from the Philippines.
lunch break done, guys. Back to school. Okay guys, group work. We have 10 minutes to do this group work. So, okay, yung iba kong ka-group or yung iba namin kasama is in the classroom. So, they are there physically. And then, some of us are doing it via Zoom. So, uh, Maybe Richard. Richard, you're on mute, but do you know? Can you recall which force we had to discuss? Uh, no. Sorry. I was supposed <laughs> to ask the same question. <laughs> Wasn't it like so potential error? Potential entrance, but I'm not sure. I might be mistaken, but Okay <laughs> Because uh, an internal flaw of work that struck me uh, most was uh, that uh, egal egalitarianism All right, yeah, I'm okay. okay group work at 1 a.m. guys group work at 1 a.m. Okay Okay, so uh, for all of you who are on the Zoom at different time zones, thank you very much for joining and being active in participation. And we'll see you tomorrow um, in various slides. Bye. Bye. Oh, done. That was eight hours of class, and I'm finally done for tonight. Sobrang nakakadrain. But then again, it's. The University of Oxford. Come on, guys. It's like the top institution in the world. So, a little sacrifice, no? Uh, all the learnings are really worth it. So... So hi guys, good morning. Uh, usually after breakfast, I start my pre-readings. Uh, so um, for today, there's a lot of essential readings and cases that I have to digest uh, before attending the class tonight. So I think I woke up around 11 in the morning, but I was too lazy to get up. So technically, I got out of bed around 12 in the afternoon. So I had my brunch. I am trying my best to focus at home because at home there's a lot of distractions that could happen but there's so much readings I have to do because we have like sort of a graded recitation. Hi guys, I actually ran out of time. So late na ako. Hindi ko natapos yung cases. I did not finish reading the cases but I have no choice but to attend the class. And hopefully I'll be able to contribute based on what I read and what I finished. Um, it depends on the jurisdiction because some labor laws are very different from the others. So, you know, That's a good you know, point. Yeah. point yeah. It's 3.30 a.m. just ended class. It was very intensive so I wasn't really able to vlog. There, there was a lot of things to do. We also had a working lunch or dinner for me. So I had to work with the group while having dinner. So I wasn't able to vlog it. And it's now 3.30 in the morning. Very tired. 
but really, really fun even if classes were conducted via Zoom. So, just eating chicken pie before I sleep. Plus this one. Korean yogurt. Yakult. So yeah, this is my overall look and I'm on my way. And I'm on my way to class. So it's now lunch break. Unfortunately, I forgot to prepare my dinner. Yeah, dinner here, lunch break in Oxford. But um, unfortunately, I forgot to air fry ahead of time. I still have to air fry the ham before I grill the sandwich. So I'm having grilled cheese and chicken ham for today's lunch. It's only 15 minutes air frying, so I have time. So I prepared some grilled cheese with chicken ham and some crisps. Yes, we call it crisps. This is what I prepared for lunch because if I'm in Oxford, this is probably what I'm going to be having for lunch. Plus the greens, but I don't have any greens right now. So for now, this is okay and I don't really have that much time. So hi guys, it's now 1.30 in the morning, so it's afternoon coffee break. That was a very long class, but now I'm having my afternoon snacks or midnight snacks because it's 1.30 a.m. here and I'm having some nuts and cheese, food for thoughts, and fit bar and yogurt. So quite a heavy snack, but I don't plan on eating after class because it's already 4 in the morning. And usually if I eat after class, I have a hard time sleeping. So better eat heavy na lang during the afternoon break. As a student, finish Oxford World Famous Bodleian Libraries. Oxford is the largest university library for racist in the UK. With over 11 million prints, volumes, and more online journals and ebooks than any other academic institutions. Okay, that's it done for today. Early end at 2 a.m. because we usually have formal halls on Thursday. So my classmates who are in the actual classroom or my classmates who are in Oxford will be having their formal dinner. Some sort of like having dinner in a Harry Potter dining hall. So it happens every Thursday or Wednesday, but it happens once a week. So they have that tonight. So for us Zoomies, um, it's time to sleep. Coffee break. So during the afternoon break, I try to catch up with cases that I have not finished. So 
Hi guys, it's almost 5 a.m. but I couldn't sleep because I'm trying to absorb everything that was taught in the lecture earlier. So I better sleep because it's the same routine tomorrow. I know it's Saturday here in the Philippines, but yeah, I do have class until Sunday at three in the morning. So. Saturday Zoom Outfit So guys, that's it for me. That was an entire week of classes. Thank you for joining me. That's technically my weekly routine from now on. That's a week in the life of an Oxford student online. Hopefully, I get to do this again when I'm finally in the University of Oxford in the UK in the next couple of weeks. Hopefully, uh, travel restrictions would loosen up and I get my student visa so I could fly there already and join my cohort. So thank you very much for watching this one. I hope you enjoyed the week with me and I'll see you soon. Bye.